Hi, I'm Megan and this is Jesse. Hey there, everybody. Jesse, tell us how your summer is going. Have you gone on any fun trips or made any new friends lately? Well, we are going to the beach soon. I'm really excited about seeing the dolphins and, uh, well, I haven't made any new friends, but I have made a new enemy. Oh, yikes, an enemy. Tell us more about that. His name is Doug, and he's always waiting for me at the monkey bars. He makes fun of me when I fall off. Uh, my arms can't carry me the whole way yet. When I fall, he points and laughs, and it makes me feel sad. Ah, I'm sorry, Jesse. That would make me feel sad too. But instead of being mad or scared of Doug, I think we should pray for him. That's what Jesus taught us to do for people we have a hard time getting along with. Pray for him? Ugh, that's too hard, Megan. Why would Jesus want me to pray for my enemy? Because Jesus taught what it means to follow him. And following Jesus makes us look different from other people. Jesus said that believers are a light in a dark world. We are called blessed when we choose to follow his ways. Well, I love Jesus and I want to follow him. Uh, I just sometimes don't know how. In the Bible, Jesus teaches us how to follow him. Let's listen to the other ways Jesus taught us how to live. Crowds of people followed Jesus wherever he went. One day, Jesus went up on a mountain. He sat down and began to teach about God's kingdom. Jesus said, Blessed are the poor in spirit, for the kingdom of heaven is theirs. Blessed are those who mourn, for they will be comforted. Blessed are the humble, for the earth will be theirs. Blessed are those who hunger and thirst for what is right, for they will be filled. Blessed are the merciful, for they will be shown mercy. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they will see God. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they will be called God's children. Blessed are those who are mistreated for doing what is right, for the kingdom of heaven is theirs. Then Jesus taught how people who believe in him should live. Jesus said that believers are a light in a dark world. Let your light shine so that others may see the good things you do. Those who see what you do will praise God, Jesus said. Then Jesus talked about God's law. Jesus did not come to take away the law, but to obey it. He said that a person can't go to heaven just because he does the right things like the religious leaders. Why a person does those things is just as important. Jesus said, Love your enemies and pray for them. God makes the sun rise on both the good and the evil, and he causes rain to fall on both the righteous and unrighteous. If you only love those who love you, what reward will you get for that? Even people who do not know God do that. Be like God, your heavenly Father. He is perfect. Jesus taught about what it means to follow him. He taught how people should live. People who trust in Jesus live to honor God and lead others to know him. 